YouTubers, and welcome to a new video of Arepas for Dinner. So for the ones who don't know me, my name is Andrea, and I've made videos about my life in the Czech Republic, but I'm actually from Venezuela. And for today's video, I actually bring you something related to both countries, because it is a video comparing Venezuelan Christmas versus Czech Christmas. I made this video about three years ago, so I imagine majority of you didn't watch it, but honestly, I've been very, very tied up with a lot of personal things lately, so I didn't have the time nor the inspiration to make a fun video. So I thought, actually, this video is very, very good. It's definitely worth re-watching. And as well, I'm actually going to Venezuela this Christmas, hopefully. So I'm gonna be showing you guys everything over there, how Christmas is, there, I don't think there's many videos about Venezuela in English. So I think that's gonna be very interesting. So stay tuned for that. Don't forget to subscribe to, be, to give this video a big thumbs up and as well to follow me on Instagram. I'm gonna leave it here because I'm actually very active, not at the moment, but usually I'm very active there. I'm, I'm gonna be sharing a lot about my trip back home in my Instagram. And as well, let me know down in the comments what are some of the Czech traditions that I didn't mention? Or if you're Venezuelan, what are some of the Venezuelan traditions that I didn't mention? I wanna know what you think. And as well, if you're from somewhere else, let me know some of your weird or interesting Christmas traditions. So that's it, let's start with the video. Hello guys, and Merry Christmas. Welcome to a new video. In today's video, I'm gonna talk about the differences between Czech Christmas and Venezuelan Christmas. First of all, we're gonna start by the obvious, the food. So in Venezuela, we eat a thing called ayacas that is pretty much uh, this, that is made out of corn dough. And then inside we put hen and pork and olives and almonds and capers and many delicious things. Also in Christmas, we eat pernil, that is pretty much uh, the leg of the pig. And we eat rice and we eat hen salad. In Czech Republic, they eat carp, which is fish. They have a soup first made with carp, and after that, they fry the carp, and they eat it with potato salad, which is very similar to our hen salad, but without hen. Number two, music. So, in Czech Republic, you have music like this one. very Christmassy. And in Venezuela, we have music more like this. Yes, we are Caribbeans, we're very festive, and even in Christmas, we wanna dance and we are gonna dance. Number three, after Christmas. So in the Czech Republic, after Christmas, you go out to the street to meet your friends and to keep on the party. In Venezuela, usually we don't do this. We go to friends' house to join their Christmas celebration or we go to a after party in somebody's house, but usually in other people's houses. Four, the presents. So in the Czech Republic, people, or at least in my husband's house, they open the presents after dinner and that can be at 9 p.m. In Venezuela, we don't open the presents, at least in my house, until after midnight, because 25th of December is when baby Jesus was born, so we don't open the presents before it's 25th of December, so we wait until midnight to open them. Five, the 25th of December. So, in the Czech Republic, you have actually a lunch in the 25th, where you eat dog, dumplings, and cabbage. And in Venezuela, at least in my family, we don't do that. The 25th, you pretty much just die and eat leftovers. And finally, some fun things I learned about Czech Christmas. One, you cannot eat meat during the day and if you don't do it, you're gonna find a golden pig. Two, you don't hang clothes on the 24th of December because it's bad luck. And three, once you start eating your Christmas dinner, you don't stand off the table because somebody will die if you do. So that was it, friends. Thank you very much for watching. You can comment below what are your Christmas traditions or even if you're Czech or Venezuelan, if you don't do these things, what do you do in your family? Thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye. So that was it, guys. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe and to give this video a big thumbs up. Also, as I said at the beginning, stay tuned for more videos coming about Christmas in Venezuela. We are going to Venezuela to do that, so that's gonna be lots of fun. And I'm gonna be trying to show everything that we do over there. So bear with me, come to my Instagram and 
follow me there as well as just follow me here and click that bell button. The only way to ensure that you're gonna receive all my videos is to not just subscribe but click the bell button and that way you'll get notifications when I publish a new video. And that's it. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day. Bye-bye.